Hey YouTube, how's everyone doing? It's Professional here. Welcome back to my playthrough of The Lost and Damned, and on this part, we're gonna be doing the final mission. I'm sorry I wasn't able to stream today, I just had a few things to do, but I'll do an early stream of Red Dead on next week. So here we go, get lost, this is the final mission. <laughs> nice place you got here, Johnny. Not quite sure I meet the dress code, but I think I like the smoking policy. What the fuck do you want? Now, is that any way to treat a friend? Are we friends? Well, I think so. You've certainly seen me naked. You want a cigar? Do you want to go fuck yourself? <laughs> oh, not particularly. But listen, your friend, Ray, don't worry about him. Why not? Apparently, he and a lot of his associates under some serious observation and in the process of imploding. They'll either be dead or inside within a month or so. Best thing you can do? Stay away from him. What about Billy Gray? Yes, well, you've got a bit of a problem there, sport. He's been talking inside. Thinks he can help pin a major drug dealing ring on you and your buddy in the chair. Thinks he's going into the witness protection program. And if he collars you, you'll do 15 years, and he'll live in a condo in Arizona. Well, I don't doubt that, Mr. Stubbs, but he's on the inside. Yeah, I know. And there's currently very large walls and armed guards between me and him. <laughs> yeah, well, you're a smart guy. You'll figure something out. If you get into trouble, you call me when you get there. I might have something to help you with it. Good. I'll need it. Hey, one more thing, Stubbs. Why are you doing this? I told you. I was good for a favor. So you see, Stubbs is actually one of the few people in the game, in GTA games, that actually, you know, keeps his word to you and he does help you out in the end. So go to the prison. And this is the, this is the Alderney State Correctional Facility. This is actually the exact same prison that Jerry is in. And what I've always been really curious about is I've been really curious, where, where is Jerry during this whole thing? Because Jerry technically would have been locked up around this time because, um, uh, because right after the diamond deal, around that time, Jerry's in prison. So Jerry would be in the prison, and, you know, if the di if the um, kidnapping missions, if those happened after this mission, you know, that wouldn't really make much sense, because then the prison would be completely shut up. So I've just always wondered about that, where Jerry is during this mission. Getting out of here? Oh, haven't you enjoyed your time in the state's care? What a fucking pleasure! So that's Billy in there, like the rat that he Jerry, is. Jerry, man, we gotta pay our friend Billy a visit. He's been talking. Bring Clay and bring all the fucking firepower you got. Meet me at the Alderney State Correctional. I'm waiting. The final run, boys. Thanks for coming, T. Speak to Terry to get free weapons. Jonathan. Now, on this part, um, you yes, get free yes. weapons from Terry. We ain't paying for this stuff, Terry. It's being used for the club. So make sure that you uh, you stock up on everything, because you can pretty much you can pretty much get everything um, free on this part. Oh yeah, here we are. Yeah, so just make sure you stock up, you get a ton of free ammo on this. Oh, that's a lot of pistol ammo. More pipe bombs. Um, let's see, what do we got here? Um, and the assault shotgun. Okay, I think that's everything pretty much there. Um, the lost MC riding together. Feels like the old days. 
Now, can you call stops? The government started taking our civil rights away. Before Terry started to think the feds were monitoring his brainwaves. Before brothers started believing their own bullshit. Come on! Congressman Stubbs cannot come to the fo- He's busy, Please get Tom. He loves democracy and wants to reform the government. He will serve you well. Visit WW for more info. Okay, let's get through that call. You boys ready? I'm about to bust this open with the rocket launcher. And Johnny has different dialogue I'm about depending- I'm to introduce a pipe bomb to that gate. I hope you're all ready. I'm gonna use this rocket launcher to blow the gate. I'm you boys ready? I'm about to bust this open with the rocket launcher. So he has different dialogue. You can use a grenade launcher, a pipe bomb, or the RPG. We're gonna use the RPG. Let's blow this open. The second we do this, alarm's gonna go off like crazy. Here we go. A lot of enemies to kill in this mission. You screws are gonna die in this shithole! Yeah, I love this shotgun so much. This is my favorite gun in the last game. Sniper on the roof, boys! Be careful! This is it! Now we're getting up to the next area here. A lot of um, SWAT and police to fight in this mission. Fuck you. M4 is definitely helping out. I remember this, the helicopters are coming now. Come on! Here we go now. Every cop has now armor. Let's fucking do this. Lost him. You better hope you kill me. Sons of bitches. Stay the fuck away. I just want to kill Billy Gray. I'll finish things with Billy. Yeah! That what you're after? Okay. Get rid of Billy now. And the thing is, I, I missed the There's combat no in um, GTA here, 4. There's William. The rules don't apply to your kind. You here to kick a brother while he's down? I'm trying to remember if Billy says anything. Come on, man. Remember, I'm not gonna ask how you got in here, brother. Pull out the pistol because it's a unique cutscene when you pull out the pistol. Checkmate, dude. Come on, get it over with. Do it! I'm doing it! Johnny can't do it. <laughs> what? You waiting for a speech or something? Come on! Come out in the open! 
So that's it there. So the the reason that Johnny hesitated is because despite despite Johnny's disagreements with um uh with Billy, all the arguments that they got into, Johnny was loyal. That's the thing about him. And so it was hard for him to kill his former um uh president, even despite all the problems that um uh that Billy caused. That's why I personally think that he spared Brian also, so when he originally Bring it here. because Bring Brian it was begging. Would have been really fuckers. funny if you actually Time saw Jerry just die. running out of the prison during this. Wonder where he is during this. Lead the loss back to the clubhouse. Okay. Billy may have helped to build our club, but he sure as shit ripped it apart. I'll forgive him the insults and injuries, but I can't forgive him that. Treacherous fucking bastard. He went insane. I wonder if you can call Stubbs here. At least he, he did say, you know, to call him. Um, no, I guess you can't. Um, Terry, Clay, thanks for rolling with me. This gang is fucked all the hell right now, but I'll love you brothers until I die. Man, I miss Jim. He was one princely son of a bitch. Best thing this gang ever had. You gotta be kidding me. Now this final cutscene is really sad. Johnny. Hey. Hey. We had fun here. <laughs> yeah, we did. But it's over. Yeah, it is. How the fuck did that happen? You know how it happens. It's that fucked up part of people, which means good is never good enough. I mean, it wasn't enough we had to be drug dealers. We also had to be outlaws, to be maniacs, to be psychos, and to be greedy, you know. Well, that combination of greed and fucked up stupidity, that works well. In the government, <laughs> not so good if you're a fucking crook. Exactly. <laughs> Ain't that the truth. Go ahead. Let's put this place out of its misery. Yeah, do what you gotta do. Come on, man, let's get out of here. So the reason they're burning their clubhouse down is because there's nothing left. Um, Terry, Clay, and Angus, Johnny, they're the only ones that are left. I know there was a few generic NPCs that followed, but they're, that's all that's left of the Lost. There's no one else left. Jim is dead, Billy's dead, Brian's dead, Brian, annoying Brian is dead. The loss fell apart into a civil war. This is definitely one of the saddest endings. And that's, that's it, guys. That's how The Lost and Damned ends. But it's not over yet. There's still a few final calls. Let me skip through this right here. Turn on audio for a second here. So, like I said, when, when you complete a mission in The Lost and Damned, there's two mission themes. There's a rock song that plays, and then there's kind of the guitar solo that plays. When it's the rock song that plays, it means, you know, something went well. If it's the guitar solo that plays, something went bad. So the guitar solo plays, you know, it's the lost, it's over. You know, it's done. But, um, uh, you know, I'm gonna... I'm gonna talk some major spoilers here, guys, so, um... 
what I'll say right now, like, this is for GTA 5, so, like, if you haven't played GTA 5 or you don't know what happens to Johnny, like, you know, stop watching at this point, um, uh, or, you know, I like to pretend personally that it ended here, you know, I, I don't like what they did in GTA 5, I know, you know, it was getting to this point, you know, people are gonna ask me, what do you think of what happened to Johnny in GTA 5, I think it's stupid. Honest, I honestly think it's really stupid and ridiculous. And I'm gonna make a video. I'm gonna make a video talking about this and how Rockstar ruined the Lost. Um, but, um, before, uh, before that, let me, uh, show you guys. There's actually a few final calls here. You can actually call Angus. You got a final call here. Let's call him. Angus, man. Chapter President. I'm president of a burnout house and some broken-ass brothers. It's dead, man. It's over. What are you gonna do? I don't know. I'll probably keep sending money to Jim's old lady and her kid. I owe him that. We all do. Beyond that, I'll probably try to cut my ties. What about Ashley? Ashley? The ice got her good. I finally cut her loose in my head, man. I don't know what's left for her other than that need to fuck up everything around her. You've been a good friend, Angus. You're a good man, Johnny. Things should have worked out better for you. Well, things should be better for a whole heap of people. It don't work out that way, do it. Adios, amigo. That is the final phone call to Angus. And if you're wondering, does Angus make an appearance in GTA 5? No, he doesn't. They completely forgot about him. They didn't bring him back. They brought back all the lost members except Angus. Um, Ashley got a phone call to her. Didn't think I'd hear from you again. I didn't think I'd call you. You hear about Billy? Yeah, I heard. Look, Johnny, look, have you got any money? I need 40 bucks. I need it real bad, baby. Not this time. You can kill yourself on your own. Goodbye, Ash. He should have never got back into a relationship with Ashley. And then we got, um, uh, Stubbs here. Johnny? Congressman? I see your problems have been resolved. Is it back to normal at the Lost Motorcycle Club? No, it ain't, Stubbs. You see, we got a set of codes that mean you can't keep on like nothing's happened after brothers turn on brothers and your world turns to shit. My, my. The man of principle. Impressive, Clement. You must find Liberty City an awful place to live. Such a shame your values are more suited to medieval times. Yeah, well, I'd prefer to stand up for something than to chop and change and stab a friend in the back to get ahead. That's why I didn't become a politician. So long, sport. Now the thing about this is Congressman Stubbs actually has some few more missions. Like, there's actually missions in the story. So there's still a few more missions left in the story, but it's not part of the main story. It's just, you know, it's kind of like the hit... Nico, you know how Nico had the Hitman missions? That, you know, those weren't really part of the main story. Um, you can complete them after you beat the game. Congressman Stubbs is actually, I think, six or seven missions. And I'll, sh I'll have a separate part for that af um, after this. And I'll also have a separate part for the random strangers. Now, Johnny can actually meet a few random strangers also. Um, and also, let's check the emails. Let's check the computer to see if Johnny got any emails. Um. Can I get you a smoke a lot of latte? Nope, there's no more final emails. That's it. Um, it was just an email to his brother. So there's no more emails, guys. Um, uh, that's it for the story of the Lost and Damned. And, you know, I'm gonna say something right now. You know, this is one of the reasons that people didn't like GTA 5's story. Not, you know, the main reason, but, you know, one of the reasons. Especially what they did to Johnny. And just how much, you know... How much Rockstar ignored the lore in, uh, in GTA 4. Because... The Lost were the way, a really Look small out. motorcycle gang compared to the Angels of Death. The Angels of Death are the largest motorcycle gang in America. And the Lost have nowhere near the amount of manpower that the Angels of Death have. They don't. Um, and the fact that, you know, the Lost pretty much collapsed in Alderney, and then all of a sudden, like, five years later, the Lost have, like, moved to uh, San Andreas, and they have, like, hundreds, like, of guys, like, thousands of guys. It's like a whole massive army, so they were able to build up this whole massive army in, like, five years after they, they said they're ending their club. It doesn't make much sense. It doesn't. The Angels of Death, they should have been the bad guys that you fight in GTA 5, not the Lost. This is where the Lost story should have ended right here. Not It, it shouldn't have come back in GTA 5. And it's just so unfortunate that... Johnny, you know, some of you guys that watched me play through this, you, you you guys didn't know about this. You guys, you guys, a lot of people thought that Johnny was just some random character that Trevor killed in GTA 5. They didn't realize he had a whole story beforehand on him. He was one of the old GTA characters. 
and the fact that, you know, Johnny was this big tough guy that, you know, took out an entire prison full of SWAT, and then five years later turns into a meth addict and gets, gets his head smashed in by a beer, with a beer bottle by an idiot. So it's like, um, uh, you know, I'll, I'll have a video giving my final thoughts on this. I'll have a video talking about this, and I'll have a video talking about Jim as well and what ended up happening to him. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. I love this DLC so much. I really did enjoy playing The Lost and Damned for you guys, and I'll still have a few more videos up for you guys. So if you guys enjoyed this series, please do drop a like because it does help me make more content like this. I, I will be playing The Ballad of Gay Tony, so I will have that coming up um, also. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one. Take care, everyone.